So the Realtor.com report showed the top 10 cities that have had sales volume decreases year over year based on November 2022 numbers. So let's take a look at that. I thought it'd be interesting to discuss this and then see what we can see on a local level, but maybe not in terms of sales volume, but maybe sales prices, I thought. So take a look at this. This is uh, where home sales are falling the most. It's uh, saying Tucson, Arizona ranks number one here. And then we have Las Vegas, Nevada following. And then Charleston, South Carolina is number three. And then Ventura County is number four. So I thought that was interesting because it hit close to home here on the Central Coast. But notice, um, as we if we take a look at that, it again, I, I want to just use a caveat here. Anytime you see these uh, these reports online, a lot of times they're clickbait. They try to draw you in to click on the data. You really want to look at a more hyper-local view, especially if you're thinking of buying or selling uh, in a certain area. Try to find someone that's sharing local information uh, that's keeping you posted on current market trends. So this is a trend back based on November numbers. So that was about three or four months ago. So let's go ahead and skip this. And we're going to get to the good part here of Monterey County. And we're looking at here sales prices, how they compared in this month of January 2022 versus January 2021. Um, or I'm sorry, 2023 January versus 2022 of January last year. So again, the, these will change in just a couple of weeks as we get the updated numbers for February. But if you're watching it on my weekly newsletter, you can really see a lot of these trends. So I'm kind of going to repeat some of what's in my weekly newsletter. But I thought I would highlight this just because of some of these reports are coming out showing trends year over year that are kind of a stale. They're a few months old. So this is for Monterey County. We can really see Castroville, Gonzales, and Carmel Valley, even Pebble Beach, all taking hits above 30% in price decreases. So if you sold a home last year at this time, overall it was about 30% more than what it was this year. So it tells a little bit of a little story there. When we move over to Santa Cruz County, uh, we can see Scotts Valley, Soquel, and Boulder Creek kind of taking the lead in the price decreases there. So uh, 33%, 31%, and 22% respectively. And then as we go to Santa Clara County, our hardest, hits er hardest hit areas are Mon Mountain View, Santa Clara, and Monte Sereno. So those are 39 29 and 28%, um, all roughly over about 30% price decreases. So if you're looking at the higher end of price decreases, we're seeing about 30% off of last year. And that might tend to be true. So Again, this is talking about an overall city. Again, each of these cities has neighborhoods within them that might be trending completely different. So always talk to your realtor, always get some local information based on what's going on today in your market. So hopefully that was informative to you. Thanks for joining us. Be, uh, be sure to like and subscribe on the channel for any future updates, and that'll keep you posted on what's going on here locally. Thanks again.